Greetings Mac Warriors, hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is TTB, welcome back to German Mac Engineering. Today guys, we're going to play the Warhammer Black Widow. I'm going to give you guys a build that works both on quick play as well as faction play. This is uh, something that you guys have been requesting, more faction play builds as well. So, Warhammer Black Widow Inner Sphere faction build, quad ultra AC5, it is slow, it packs a punch, it has enough ammo to do some good damage and it just looks damn beautiful. Let's go into the build, shall we? Well, I already spilled the beans, we've got quad ultra AC5s, that means we have to lower the engine rating quite a bit to be able to fit all these heavy weapons. That means we have a light engine 225 to power our mech, one double heat sink extra that is needed so that we can even run this mech because the light engine only has nine internal heat sinks, we need 10 to be able to run the mech, so there you have it, it's in the right arm, which has zero armor by the way, but we'll get to that in a second. So, as you can see, everything in this mech is literally quad UX5s and ammo plus one extra double heatsink. We have shaved the head a little bit, we've shaved the legs a little bit, we've completely shaved the arms because we don't really need them. And uh, yeah, we used endo steel and uh, double heatsinks. Damage on this mech is 40, which is a double tap of the uac 5s Speed, 52 kph. So this heavy mech has the same speed as, let's say, for example, an Atlas. It is very slow, but it doesn't need to be fast, guys. It is a longer range to medium range precision DACA instrument capable of delivering 40 pinpoint damage very quickly at a range of 650 meters. That is more than two Gauss rifles. Yes, you have to shoot twice, but you get the point. This thing has range, it has the ability to sustain its damage quite a bit, and it is a fun mech to play. Just make sure you're not the only guy at the front line because you're gonna get murdered very, very fast. For the skill tree, well, that is very, very simple if you guys watched my skill tree videos. Build towards your strengths. By the way, I highly recommend you watch my skill tree building video. It's in the uh, new player guides. Now, what do we do? Well, we have UX. So, UX enhanced 1 and 2, magazine capacity 1 and 2, as many heat gen nodes as we can gobble up, all the velocity nodes to make our projectiles fly a little bit faster, survival tree, a left hand side of survival tree down to the maximum armor hardening, plus a little bit of scale density on the right hand side as well. Um, then we have the ability to go into sensors, for example, if you want to do this for faction play, it can be very beneficial if you go, for example, for full radar deprivation. So let's say you went for full radar deprivation, seismic sensor, still got a lot of points left. Um, I don't think you have problems with overheating too much in this mech, so you could just go for double artillery strike and a cool shot. And then we have some more points left, so once again, we just go ahead and armor up our mech a little bit more, grab the armor hardening node, uh, grab two more nodes of skeletal density, and boom, there you have it. That is a complete skill tree for your mech. Go ahead and try it out on the battlefields, and if you need some inspiration of how to play this mech, the videos about to follow will teach you how to do this. Remember, keep firing, assholes. Enjoy. All right, let's see what we can do here. Oh, I've got... I thought I was in the... Yeah, yeah, never mind. I thought for a second I was still my sun spider, I don't know. I'm in a... I'm in an assault Black Widow now. Ultra AC5s all the way, baby. Hello? He's just sitting there shooting the wall. Oh, you lost, little fellow. I probably was setting up his uh, weapon groups. The main drawback of this black water is just the speed. In faction play, you can play this alongside your assaults, right? But quick play speed might bite me in the ass. But I'm using the term speed here very liberally. Because as you can see, it goes 52 kph. But at least I'm beautiful while I'm going slow. It has some good firepower though, it has 4 uic 5s I mean, this thing has the firepower of that kingcrab that we ran a couple of days ago unsuccessfully. Oh no, they're rotating hard. This is not good. Like the Echo 4 Delta 4 corner is what we, what uh, worries me right now, and there is some worry already. It's a Vapor Eagle. Strike online. 
Okay. Ganz schön, dass wir da dafür. I know what, I'm gonna join this guy. He's got the right idea. The enemy team is bunched up in Charlie 4. Let me team is bunched up Charlie 4. Just hold some angles here if you can. Uh, stuck. Okay. Just gonna walk backwards pretty soon, I think. No? Yes? Am I still on top of this thing? Yeah, barely. Oh. I missed. Hey, yeah, yeah. More dudettes on the ground that are completely useless and not needed. They're just there to be annoying. Are you coming back for more? Rip. It's a brawl of Epic Eagle. Gonna try to see if I can support my teammate from up top here. That was not too bad. Let's hold here for a sec. Gonna move back here to this side. Try to guard this corner as much as I can. There's a dude over here somewhere, but I don't know exactly where he went. <sighs> New target acquired. He just doesn't want to die. The guy is immortal. It's a freaking Highlander. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, he's dead now. Let's stay up top here. I only have 92 rounds left though, so... Hmm. Let's try and use them all. Is that a dude? Nope. Might be dead dude. Rip. That's a leg of somebody though. Ouch. Toasty! Way too toasty. 28 rounds left. Rip. Hey, I killed the dude that was yoo-hooing. Yoo-hoo! I got 12 rounds left. <laughs> oh, hello, you rang? Rip. Out of ammo. <laughs> that wasn't bad though. That was a fun round. That was a fun round. That's a that's a faction play build in solo to you. Not bad. Yo, oh, we got we got a piranha with one leg. It's the one it's the one legged fish stick. Rip. My mods are sleeping. I just banned that dude. Okay, three killing blows, three assists, two solo kills, three kill most damage dealt, 945 damage done, 450 damage taken, five components destroyed. Top damage in the match. It's actually funny, like my team has the higher spike damage numbers, the enemy team has the higher average damage numbers, I feel. Charger did good on the enemy team, Calibur did okay-ish, uh, Fafner did good on the enemy team, and the Cyclops, thank you.
On my team, we had the Executioner doing well. Corsair doing well as well. And then, yeah, 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 then the Timberwolf Warrant also doing a, a good job here. GG's. That was a fun match though. Even though we lost, that was a fun match. Wonder if the enemy team is gonna push low. We'll see in a sec, I guess. Hey, the slow speed really hurts this warmer, but the Daka ability is just so nice. Like for an Innisfere Heavy, this is beautiful Daka power. Such Daka, much love. Oh. Oh, hello. Hello, good sir. Sir. I missed three shots. Wow. Okay. Dude. Target spotted. Artillery strike activated. Eight level critical. Oh, he's right in the artillery strike. It's gonna hurt him. Let's go here, maybe. Shoot his arm. I can shoot through here. Hell uh, yeah! I'm too toasty, though. Damn it, the toast is real! RIP. They can't see! Oh, something behind us. A top behind us, careful. Our no, team is rotating away from us, not good. That's a big miss. Hmm, how can I help him? Maybe I push around? Get another half miss. Get out of the way from me, dude. Get away in front of me. <laughs> Down in front! Down in front! <laughs> okay. PSP backwards, nope. He YOLO's into doom, okay. Goodbye, Fafnir. He YOLO to his doom. He doesn't know the zo zombie Target secret. Yalt, you only live twice. There's the cougar. Where are you going, little boy? Come on. Let me at him. Rip. Come back here, you little rascal. Target destroyed. <laughs> nah, I missed a lot of shots though, but that was a fast one. was a fast match. Two killing blows, two KDDs, 729 damage done. No damage done. <laughs> Basically no damage taken. I grazed the teammate once, I think. Seven components. Not bad. Top damage in the match. 424 match score. I can live with that. Slow mech. A good damage. Both the Uziels did good. Uh, the Cyclops did good as well, my team. Uh, enemy team was mostly the Huntsman and the Assassin doing something. The rest, too much time running around, not enough time shooting. GG's.